What is up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to NASCAR Heat Evolution Championship Series. We're for race 14 at Pocono Raceway, the Tricky Triangle for the Exalta 400 after a surprising win in the Coca Cola 600 and a last lap pass past Kevin Harvick. Uh, in the Charlotte, we got the win there. We have three wins on the season. Uh, Pocono, we start 16th in today's race. Not really sure what's going to happen in this race. It is the tricky triangle, so never know what's going to happen. So let's head out to Pocono, ladies and gentlemen. I believe Joey O'Donnell is on the pole. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Green flag in Pocono. care of everything oh we got hit by Ryan Ellis <coughs> so caution Jimmy Johnson in trouble well what happened was Carl Edwards got in the back of me Put us here in the back of the pack, so. The race is going green. Here's the green flag. So we start all the way back in the pack. So 15 laps to go here in Pocono. Yeah, 
that side of Bobby Labonte. The 37. Still there. Oh, did he have one? Knocks Jets into the wall. Hamlin around. Carlo. The trouble in turn two. No caution. Boy, Denny Hammond. Denny Hammond drove in the back of me there. Same thing what happened to his teammate Carl Edwards. Still there. Carlo, you're all clear. Denny Hammond's going to be way in the back. You're just all bottled up. Still there. Clear low. Car low. Car low. And I got nowhere to go, and every time I try to make a pass, I get hit in the back. I don't know what I'm Stay supposed low. to do. Still there. Oh, Still Dan there. Coming out after being low. Car high. Still there. <coughs> we were going to the front. Hi, you're all clear. And our teammate Casey King nearly got into us there, so Harvick back up to 26. Harvick and Jimmy Johnson, a great battle in the 600, a race to go. Still there. At the 26th and 27th, a week later. High. All clear. Clear high. Oh, oh, get the wall. Yeah, it's not been a good race. We've been stuck in traffic the whole time. Stay low. Still there. Leaders eight seconds ahead with coming to ten You're laps to go. Sideways and they save it. Wow. I had I got on the apron, I hit the brakes and the car got sideways and Trevor Bain and and uh Kyle Larson both got in the back of me. Very fortunate we didn't have a crash okay, there. Okay, that's the halfway mark now. So ten laps to go here in Pocono. Still 
Nine laps to go at the start finish line. Still there. We're almost back to where we qualified in this race. In 16th position. Stay low. Still there. All clear. He had a potential race winning car and just found trouble in this race. That was a great lap. <coughs> Just looking for a top 10 if we could get it. Catching Austin Dillon for 15. Seven laps to go with Buffalo. Put it up in five. Still there. Clear high. With 10.6 seconds behind the race leader. Six to go. Before Chase Elliott ahead of me. Kevin Harvick has come back from the back of the pack. He's up to 17, so a great recovery by Kevin Harvick. Recovery for Jimmy Johnson as well. <coughs> Five laps to go. It could have been a win at Pocono, but just a costly mistake on my part. Hurt our chances. Sideways underneath. I believe that, yeah, that's Kyle Bush in 13, so Kyle Bush struggling a little bit in this race. Coming to four laps to go here in Pocono. Still there. Stay low. Still there. Four laps to All go. Clear. Kevin Harvick is fast, ladies and gentlemen. He's right behind Stay all low. of us here. Car high. All right, ladies and gentlemen, coming down to three laps to go. 
Good battle for 12. Kevin Harvick right behind us. Kevin Harvick getting a run on the end. Great bad fall. Kevin Harvick with three wins on the season. Jimmy Johnson, three wins. Back here, 13th and 14th. Bound from a win a week ago. Charlotte. Still there. To a great drive to the, through the field. Two laps to go in Pocono. Jimmy Johnson in 12th. Here you go. It might not have been the day that we were looking for in Pocono, but. Very happy with this performance of a rebound after what happened. I believe on lap three, I believe so, lap three or four. So a good rebound for top 15 finish. We're not gonna make the top 10. I'll, it does appear that we will not have a caution to close this race out. So here we come, ladies and gentlemen. White flag in the air. I believe Joey Logano out in front. Last lap. Here we go. Last lap here in Char here in Pocono. Excuse me. A good rebound by Jimmy Johnson today. At the running six, when him and Carl Edwards make contact. Kevin Harvick a great rebound as well. Up in 13. Turn three for the final time. In the tricky triangle, and we're gonna finish 12. All right, I'll take a 12 place finish. That's worth a few points. A good day after getting involved in a wreck. day. It was a great day. That's what you're really going to put the race. We're going with the second win of the season is starting points. We will look at everything as soon as we get back into the main menu here. All right. Moments from now, so let's go check out the race results from Pocono, the Exalted 400. So, Joey Logano wins, Martin Truex second, Ricky Stenhouse third, Kurt Busch fourth, Carl Edwards finishes fifth, Matt Kenza sixth, Dale Earnhardt Jr. seventh, Holman Art eighth, Brad Keselowski ninth, and Casey Mears tenth. Uh, yeah, Clint Boyer eleventh, uh, me finishing twelfth, Harvick thirteenth, Greg Biffle fourteenth, Cobb fifteenth, Chase Elliott sixteenth, Austin Dillon seventeenth, uh, Ryan Newman 21st, Kyle Larson 22nd, Danica Patrick 24th, 
Jimmy Livermore, 26, Tony Stewart, 27, AJ Allmendinger, 29th, um, Eric Jones, 35th, Casey Kane, 36th, Chris Buescher, 37th, and rounding in last place is Danny Hamlin. So let's go check out the championship standings. As it currently right now, we obviously the points don't really matter as we check it the rest of the way right here. So Kevin Harvick and Jimmy Johnson have the front are tied for the front row. Sees the Tony Stewart in the final transfer spot. Dale Hunter Jr. 15th. <coughs> so eight different winners have won. Harvick, me, Joey Logano, Danny Hamlin, Brad Keselowski, Matt Kenseth, Kurt Busch, and Eric Amarola, who got the win at Richmond. Kyle Busch, Carl Edwards, Ryan Newman, Sid House, Greg Biffle, Casey Mears, Dale Hunter Jr., and Tony Stewart are currently in. Right now, Ryan Blaine is 22 points out of the chase for the championship. So, let's quick... Oh, I accidentally backed out. Uh, where is Ryan... Martin Tricks is 24th in points. And he's got a good ways to go. So, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this race. Uh, the 14th race of the season is in the books. We get ready for the 15th race of the season at, the, at Michigan. So, hope to see you guys there. And I will see you guys at Michigan. Looking to rebound after a top 12 finish to a 12th place finish in this race. So, thank you again for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm Hot Revolution, and I'll see you guys at Michigan.